What's going on guys, this is Makai. We're back for another Bleach Rebirth the Souls character breakdown trailer. This time we got Gen Ichimaru. In the beginning, Gen Ichimaru's sword Shinzo is showcased. We however get the name of the Bankai, Kamishini no Yari, which is showcased. In the blink of an eye, as you look at it, it's shown to extend very fast. This teases what's in store for what the blade can ultimately do. The captain of squad 3 with the fastest Zanpakuto that swallows Ichimaru's opponent with a single blow hidden in a blade ballet. Gin starts to fight off with Shinzo in hand. This is made more evident when we get the description of his signature attack. Gin is in his Soul Society costume. I imagine his Arankar costume will be a thing and ultimately you can switch out between the two. Gin's initial gameplay shows he's a fast character. The gameplay also shows another new stage. It appears to be the Rukon district just outside of the Serite. In fact, if you pay close attention, Gin is fighting against Ichigo, which most likely could be a story mode segment that's being showcased to us. The first ability Gin Ichimaru shows off for a signature attack is Serpent Strike. This ability extends Shinzo towards the opponent with a high speed thrust. Holding input strengthens the performance. This is showcased when he uses it and a blue aura is presented. This looks to increase the damage of the attack. This ability was first showcased in a Gin vs Ichigo, their first fight. Gin uses this ability to push back Jidambo and Ichigo preventing them from going into the Serate. Gin's first spiritual pressure move is called Orozuki. Orozuki is described as Ichimaru turns his back to the opponent to catch them off guard, then extends his Shinzo to counter attack. If the counter attack lands, he activates snake possession and the attack damage of the tip of Ichimaru's spear is enhanced. The closest example of this is when Gin is about to finish all Toshiro. He turns his back in their fight and he extends his blade. At the last second, Rangiku stops it, but this looks to be the exact example they're using this off of. Gin's second spiritual pressure attack is called Shinzo Sozin. This move is described as a cleave, a wide area with Shinzo. If the attack lands, it extends for a follow-up attack. In Bleach Soul Resurrection, Gin uses a similar ability as one of his stances where he does a wide cleave attacking a series of opponents around him. As for Gin's Awakening, he activates his Bankai, his Bankai being Kamishini Yuniyari. There's no escape. Kill him. Kamishini no Yari. His Bankai is described as by releasing Kamishini no Yari, Ichimaru's range of attack increases, allowing for a fighting style that keeps opponents at bay. Now the next part of the gameplay, Gin looks like he's fighting fast, I think he's using one of his abilities, but again it looks freaking cool. This is one of the other characters besides Chad that actually looks fun to play with. This is probably going to be a day one play for me. I know most people are like, you're going to play with Aizen, nah, it's going to be Ichimaru so far as like a, one of the characters I'm playing. In the last portion of the gameplay, we see what might be his ultimate. The only attack I can make out of this is the Pluto attack where he holds the sword with two hands in front of him and he launches the extending attack very fast. He uses this against Ichigo in their second fight during the Fate Katakura Town arc. Genichi Maru is squad 3 captain and he's described as a strong medium to long range combatant, utilizing long reach abilities to keep opponents at bay. Now, most people were anticipating this trailer was going to be Renji, as we kind of had an idea that they would showcase all the characters they shown in the first trailer and then go on to a new trailer, drop more characters and kind of slowly burn out. But it seems like it's going to be a different way. In fact, I theorize we won't see Renji for another two trailers. I think the next trailer we're going to get showcased is Ikaku. Now, I could be wrong. Now, the Kubo Club uh, crew in B-side is having gameplay drop on the 8th of September. I will be live. I'll be dropping a video probably later today describing more and what we can realistically expect from that. So make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel so you don't miss that video and turn on notifications so that way you don't miss that live. With that all being said i am makai san hit the like button subscribe and i'll catch you guys later what yo